All right, hello everybody. I'm Scout Eighty Three, and this is Medieval Engineers. And obviously, I've been playing it quite a bit lately since they did their November update. It was about mid-November, so it's been a it's been almost two months since the last up since they did the update. And I've been playing quite a bit of this. I really love um, how Medieval Engineers is starting to come out, and um, just stay there. Um, but obviously you can see my castle down there and, uh, I got some stockades out around the, uh, outside, but, um, obviously I've been a little bit busy. All right, guys, let's get rid of this barbarian. How are you doing? How? Yeah, you better die. Thank you. I'll take that. You can keep the wooden club and your skull. I'll leave. I'll leave that there. I'm not the predator. Um, so let's go walk down here and see. Was built. What was it? Oh yeah, that's right. I was getting sticks. I just put up this stockade on the outside of this, and you know what? One thing I don't like is the distance that they've changed it to. You used to be able to pick things up at a greater distance this is probably more realistic but you know it's it's still kind of far um but as you can see my castle originally the outer castle the outer walls were um stockades and you know i've got different things so anyway i'm walking in here this was my garden i'm probably gonna put some buildings here eventually but or my uh, crops I also have some crops that were over here. But obviously this is very basic. This is basically just to defend against um, bandits. Because obviously this is not the most secure thing in the world. Parts of this are just a little more than fences. Come on, I know I can jump over this. Can't I? Yeah. Ha! Uh, maybe. Okay. I can't get back in. What have I done? I'm stuck out here. Okay, let's go back around to the door. But, um, obviously this is a little bit lower. I kind of would like to have this higher, but it's because of the weird way that is, it's not, it doesn't work so well. But, um, yeah, you've got these little towers here and, and, um, uh, gatehouse, which I love the, the fact that you walk in through one gate. You've got all these spaces be shot at as you're walking in plus the palisades and uh, the cart decided to come over and say hi to the gate I love these um, portcullis I don't know why I said palisades um, you're in the way excuse me get out of the way okay that you're in, oh, now I'm stuck there okay oh yeah and then the, there's a keep over here which I need, I'm going to raise those up. That's my next big thing, is raising these towers up one not one block higher. Come on. Come on. You can do it. There we go. Come on. Come on. You can do it. I'm going to talk to the cart like it's a dog or something. What? Is there a barbarian on the other side of this yeah see yeah there is one I walked near the wall and he swung at me it's not a good idea I don't have a crossbow with me right now I'm gonna come out and deal with you later oh ow if I don't kill myself first um, obviously I don't have I have um, though I don't have any way to get onto that from over here unless I jump but anyway, um, you got an outer wall. I didn't feel like with this tower so close because I've got this tower here and I've got that tower there. I didn't feel like I needed to actually. Where are you? Oh, wow. He's actually wandering around. I didn't used to do that.
Hi! Ow, you actually dodged my attack. Well, they made these things, these guys, they did make these guys a little bit tougher, didn't they? Okay, thank you for... You got a treasure map. And a copper pickaxe. I'll take both of those for right now. Thank you. Have a good day. Okay, so anyway, what was I doing? Um, this here, well, obviously, this is my crafting area. Obviously, I've got a forge and a... Well, forge and a... Um, blacksmithing station and a tanning rack. And I've got an ore pile and crafting table i've got at one point all of these did have logs on them because i had i had three things full because i took down all the stockades and replaced them with stone walls and those those things were completely full but now i then i built those stack stockades out there to create an extra area and of course i got my other things in the warehouse which is right here warehouse that's where i have everything i also have the um kiln in the warehouse because well I, I just put the kiln in the warehouse. Although I might need the space for other things. So I might have to figure out somewhere else for the warehouse. Um, I've got a milling stone here. Why? Because I can. I've got the actual mill here, which is here. Actually, now I think you can actually put these walls on the thing. Only thing is they changed the recipe, which I thought these were just called wooden walls before. Now they're called clay walls, and they were like, oh made it a requirement for clay for clay walls well i mean i'm pretty sure they were just called wooden walls before i'm actually okay with them being clay walls because that's what they more look like anyway but um but it's just, just kind of funny um so anyway i love the mechanical blocks that they've added um i did not go to the barracks that's kind of important don't you think so anyway Go into this door, and you've got the barracks. And uh, let me go ahead and... Wait, is there a place on here to... Is there a place on any of these? Yep, there. Let's throw that there. Can I put that there? I can. I can put an old destroyed sword on the sword rack. I was just curious. Um, I am running one mod, um, which is immersive furniture or something like that. I, 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 I might be wrong. I have a little fireplace here with a stove. It's kind of silly, really, but um, I just did because I could. We got a wardrobe, of course, in the barracks so that, so that the soldiers or whoever can dress. There's a little room here. Why? Because I don't have a good reason for that. The fireplace comes out there, the smoke, which is not ideal for obvious reasons. Um, and yeah, you got the gatehouse where you can shoot down anybody who's trying to come in um and then you've got you can go upstairs to the um come on there we go stairs to the tower and from here you can see down and you can uh you've got meticulations sorry i should say it like uh shad if you know, anybody knows who shad is meticulations sorry i, I couldn't help myself um and um yes it's awesome sorry Th and this is just the guardhouse this is kind of supposed to be kind of a or um the barracks and it's kind of like a small little fortress inside a fortress i've got a a um oh, i got i got stuff in there i didn't realize i had stuff in there um crafting table on the roof in the tower because of this this is tall slightly was supposed to be slightly taller so that it could be a little bit of a kind of a watchtower but, you know, you can see all kinds of stuff from here. And this is basically, it's a weaker version of the keep. The keep has thicker walls. Um, and it's my residence. Um, so let's move on. And I've got bad X written on there. Sorry, I really enjoy this game. It's funny, I play Minecraft. Well, I haven't played Minecraft since I've gotten this, since I started, since they've released this last, a big update although they just released another update that added um wooden walls and some more stuff for mechanical blocks i kind of wish i had that before i did this because i could have done mill and sawmill 
both in one building. I might be able to figure out. I might be able to do that still. I just gotta make it work. Um, I might, now that they've made it so that you can actually put these walls on these other th other things, I can actually put these walls because they, they're protruding right now because I couldn't put them in the other blocks, but now they changed it so you can actually cover up this as well, which is kind of cool. I'm probably going to do that. Um, this building, before we go into the castle, or the keep, excuse me, you know, you've got basic walls. They're not the most, this, this is not the most impressive castle, but it's, you know, limited by buildings and I really want to get these towers up one notch above the others just because it's it's more functional um, but you can see the surrounding area I like this area I, I kind of wish it was more fl I had built on a flat flatter area but you know it's okay nothing's perfect you can build on the wall and all that but anyway then this is uh, my friend's house Doc Mazov he um built this i helped out a little bit i built furniture it was funny when we were um when i because i was building the furniture and handing it and leaving it for him um so it was funny because it looked like we were actually moving him in because as i was building the furniture i was just leaving it out here so it's just like there was just furniture everywhere and he'd come and grab it and put it in the house somewhere so i thought that was kind of funny because it's just like oh it, it actually looked like he, an actual, like he was moving in. Um, all right, so into the keep, I kind of built uh, kind of a little guardhouse. It's kind of weird the way it is, but, you know, it was one of the few things I could do. Since this isn't full-size walls, it, I, you know, it's kind of limited as to what I could do, but I wanted meticulation so that you can shoot off the sides. And I've got a little bit of, I'm using ledges here to create things. So you've got a door there that you have to get through if I can close it there it goes and you know you, you so you'd have to get through that door and you you're gonna have people shooting at you and then you will have to get through this door and you're still gonna have people shooting at you of course once you're in here you're pretty good um, the walls are a little bit thinner because you know they're thick walls up until you get to the top lever level lever level but um, it was just resources really that is the reason why that's the way it is um, but it works pretty well I, I almost want to put thicker walls but they're not really much point because no one's going to attack me because right now we only have barbarians there's no like AI siege system or anything like that it would be awesome if they could get servers going um, like really functioning properly um, we'll see but you know you could this way you've got these towers and you can shoot at these i'm going to actually raise all of these towers up by one and um of course from the here you can like shoot in down through here you can you've got actual meticulations here so you can actually shoot down below and you can shoot over here and you can actually walk oddly over here and shoot at anybody who's there and shoot down and yeah you got a lot of angles on anyone trying to get into the keep and you can just generally see things better. And once I raise these towers up one more uh, space, I think it'll be much better. I've got one furnace up here because there was just an extra furnace and I just put it up here. Originally, I had all the crafting area on the roof of the castle. Um, I should probably show you other things oh i made custom stairs so that i could fit within one block that's one thing i really love about this game is like you can take the boards and like notch them up and this is just planks across here and i've just built custom stairs i, I love the fact that you can kind of do some customization stuff in in this game um so anyway then there's my bedroom which has the uh research table and library and my bedroom i built a custom um, table side bed, um, tables, bedside table. That's the word I was looking for. I'm saying it backwards. <sighs> I'm showing dyslexia, which I am actually dyslexic, but that's okay. And I've got a small table and I've got my tool rack, which doesn't have, do, does, do, doesn't, doesn't have any tools on it right now. One of these days I'm going to learn how to speak. I promise. 
but you know, and then I've got a chest that just has like my crossbow bolts and a few other miscellaneous stuff. And uh, I got another map piece. Where I keep my map pieces in this one. And then my schematics, which I don't have any because I uh, was giving my friends skills. There's my wardrobe and everything. So anyway, you go out of the bedroom. And you go into the dining area. And of course, you got the basic dining area. Chandeliers, tables, seats. And then, of course, you got the kitchen, which I built this, this like, windowed area using just, um, um, timbers. And actually, I did have wooden planks across, which I really love the look of, but this is more functional, where you've just put a shelf right there at the beginning, and you can put all that there. It's just more functional, because that way you don't have to walk into the kitchen. You just walk around the corner and, you know, just eat things off of the counter like that. I like that. Yeah, now now the counter's empty. But anyway, then you walk into the kitchen. There we go. Light. And, you know, obviously I've got some shelf with some stuff. I've got ingredients in here. I probably should put another chest, like, underneath there for more stuff. And, then of course, the um, all-important... Um, What am I thinking? I'm, I'm wanting to say stove. No, it's an oven. Yeah, it's an oven. It's not a stove. I was thinking stove is not really the right word. Um, I do really love. I love the. I love the stuff. The fact that I can make something like this here and just put that there, and I, I just love the game. So anyway, then um, of course that's the for crafting material and stuff cloth and all and the likes if i can get this door open seems like i'm having trouble selecting things suddenly down here this was an originally that there was a palisade around everything and i just basically left it except for the fact that i put some more palisades over here at, to function as walls because i just kind of like the look and this was originally just a storage area with no floors it looked like this and uh, then I built on top of it and then I uh, built walls around it and then I went through and there's my claim block and then I eventually turned this room into my barracks basically but as I built the barracks outside I moved that out and I haven't really done anything with this room yet I don't know what I'm gonna do with it and uh yeah so that's a tour of my castle I'm trying to think if there's anything else i have not done i think that's about it did i put up my no i did not put up the hammer so they changed here in the last update how you get steel you have to use um is it linseed oil in order to make steel in order to quench it which is kind of interesting, which makes sense. Steel might be a little bit e too easy to make. It's more, it was more complicated than other things, but still probably too easy to make. As much as I kind of hate to admit it, because... Because I like... Oh, okay. So anyway, what I'm going to do is make these things higher. I'm going to go ahead and do that while I'm doing this recording. Just thinking, watch me, my inventory fill up and they drop a bunch of things. Yep. I knew that was going to happen. I didn't destroy anything, did I? Doesn't look like it. Should have, uh, probably built these walls before doing that last bit. I knew that was going to happen. Let me build these walls and then we'll go down and get the other parts. One of these, I have stairs on there. It is five.
Okay, now let me go down and get all that stuff. I think. Yeah, I'll go ahead and go get that stuff that I dropped. If I can get it in my inventory. Anything else? No, looks like I got it all. Yeah, that'll be much better. Could actually probably get away with... Let me see. I wonder if I can do that. Could I actually... Well, see, the problem is, of course, no matter how I do it, gonna have space above it of course I could build that down there build a wall curved wall down here hold on where are you not you not you not you well I could do that on the corners or I could just build a square block on the corners here that will probably require more material Hold on. Why can't I build you? There is a question I want answered, and that is, what is in your way? I don't see anything in your way. You should be able to be built. Hmm. That is interesting. Oh, yeah, you know what? The walls are in the way. I should have thought of that. Just thinking. What I should I do is probably find somewhere to throw a bunch of my inventory stuff. And it'll be here because this table is going to be a chest. I was kind of semi-worried that things might fall down. Obviously, this is hollow. Yeah, there we go. Very... Yep. Very useful. Then I can just... I might eventually thicken these walls. I'm going to have to actually probably go ahead and do that because that's going to be... Make these walls fully... I need to at least um, go from the half planked all the way up to planked floors on the around the edges. Because this doesn't really work this way. Because obviously I can't get over here. Well, no, I can. I have to at least do these corners here. All right, cool. Now, what I need... All right, cool, I can put that there. Whoa, don't wanna walk around off the corner. Put that there. that there yes okay cool Oop. built this about a stone need to make these I need to make flanked floors here one there one there actually that'll work fine for that except the fact I'm out of planks I'm out of everything so anyway what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna raise these up that'll look much better than just the level it is. Plus, it'll be more functional. All right. 
Yeah, it'll look much better. I'm still gonna leave the one side open because it's just... It's not... It's cool, but not functional. I have to raise it up one more notch. And uh, that might be a little bit overkill. Cool. Alright, let me grab this. Let me grab a few of these. I need more wood, don't I? Because I need more planks. I got planks in the warehouse. Hold on. How many? I've got five planks. That's not going to be enough. Excuse me. You're coming with me. Take a few of those. Make some of those. Oh. I'll be able to finish this one. And I finished that one already. I'm going to have to go get some more stone and everything. Oh, and I need planks, which I... Yes, okay, good. They are finished over there. But not enough. Come on. Any second now. Right? Okay. Should be still making planks. It is making planks. Apparently I'm just out of range or something. Well, I did have those planks in my inventory, so that makes a degree of sense, doesn't it? does make a degree of sense. All right, let's finish that. And okay, now we're talking. I should just make a full set of plank floors around here. I really don't need that whole corner like that for everything. I just need planked floors all the way around, although it would be preferable just for strength of the tower. But I think it would be just fine without it. It's probably, this is probably unnecessary. But I do need to explain it, expand, expand the floors. And then I'll raise all those up and then that'll look much better. Let's see, hold on, let's go step outside. Yeah, see, it looks much better. It looks taller. It means that the keep is actually more pronounced than anything else. Which it should be. And, um... Yeah, see? Yeah. Looks much better. It should be raised up above the regular battlements. I'd love to have uh, articulations all the way across, but you know, you can only do what you can do. Um, so anyway, um, I think that's all I'm going to do for this video right now. I'm going to eventually, I'm going to eventually, I'll raise all of these up, make it a little bit more pronounced, and that way it will look, it just be look much better and be much higher. Um, but I wanted to show everybody what I was, what I've been doing. And uh, medieval engineers, I've never done showed this on the channel. And um, you know, it's a fun game, and I've been playing a lot of it. And I was like, well, I should probably. I haven't shown it because it's not space engineers, but I'm like, well, it is medieval engineers, and um, it is something I've been doing. So, yeah, I figured I might as well go ahead and show you what I have been doing in medieval engineers so anyway i hope you enjoyed this video and um thank you for watching